Hey, what it do, YouTube? Happy New Year's. It's your boy, Richard904, coming back at y'all with a brand new video, man. And today, today, we're bringing in the first video of the year with a good little reaction, man. We starting off strong, man. We back where we left off last year. But this year, we're just going to apply all the knowledge that we gained from 23. And we're going to apply it to 24, man. We're just going to be a better player man we're not gonna be a new one we're gonna be a better one that's all we gonna do you know what i'm saying improvements and steady you know just going up all year bro just working hard the ethics gonna be there all year i want to make sure that i bring a lot of reactions a lot of music videos a lot of just day in the lives just just any types of video that i can get out there i just want to make sure that i bring it out to y'all and just have content going all year man real genuine content none of that fake shit none of that you know what i'm saying smash or pass none of that none of that lame shit that y'all be seeing some 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 seattle niggas do bro we coming at y'all with the real deal so with that being said we're gonna be reacting to rg sleeves k bg simba 5k and rg dre this new song allah akbar that i seen get posted to real clips uh real page and shit like that and I seen it, and I was like, yo, these niggas are definitely coming with that aura, that Blitz the League aura, that, that motherfucking EBK flow aura. So we're going to see what the fuck these boys is talking about. We're going to see if their music is good or if it's ass. Listen, this is my first time ever uh, listening to their music. But listen, if you guys react to my video, listen, you guys. Everything that I say here, constructive criticism. Everything that I say here, the truth. The genuine, honest opinion. The most genuine and honest opinion you get. I'm not going to be your bros who are just going to dick ride and be like oh yeah that shit fire bro that shit fire no nigga that shit ass i'm gonna let you know you know what i'm saying but do not take it offensively i'm not one of y'all i'm just a youtuber i'm a critiquer let's get into it let's see what these boys are talking about man shout out real clip for shooting the video as well man one of the best videography teams that we have out here bro shout out to manzano bros and shout out everybody who works with them man happy birthday happy birthday Bro, AJ came on, all them, all them other dudes, bro. I like, I hope that, like, did they send this song to them before, before sending, uh, before dropping the video? Like, I seen, I seen, I seen this little post this video where it was like, bro, you, 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 you dissing the option shit. This song is for them. You might as well just send it to them. And I feel like that's one of the truest things I've ever heard in my life, bro. The diss music be going hard, but at a point it's like, bro, just send it to these niggas, man. <laughs> this song look made. This song sounds like it was made for them type shit. These niggas got some lit ass props. I ain't gonna lie, but so far, Sleeves K, he's spitting. I fuck with it, but please, brother, retire the EBK flow this year, man. We got to start coming up with our own unique individual sounds. Everybody needs to sound unique from the next person, bro. I understand that the EBK flow is the wave and everything right now, bro, but too many people are using that shit for it to still be, you know what I'm saying? We got to come up with some new shit. He's spitting. Don't get me wrong. He coming with some catchy ass bars. Don't get me wrong. But that flow, everybody's using it. So it just sounds like the other nigga using it. You know what I'm saying? Man, but so far, man, song, song low key pretty hard. These niggas got buttons, bro. These niggas, these niggas, the real button boys. Listen, I ain't gonna lie. If I'm a five guy and I watch this fucking video, nigga, I'm retiring, nigga. I, I, I'm retiring, nigga. I'm waving my white flag, bro. Cause this, listen, the nigga, like, imagine you're a five guy and you get caught lacking at the party. You're not out running. You're not out running this team. 
They're not outrunning this team. Uh-uh. These niggas is full on hawking you down, bro. And all it takes is that one button press. And nigga, yeah, it's over. Jedi ran and left his little brother, so they smoke little sleeves. I bounce out with 33, and they think it's GG. Glock 17, binary with a green beam. Bitch, I'm trying to smoke a five, nigga. Where's little yummy? Walk up on that nigga with nickel, he died like a dummy. Dead body, brought that nigga up. Now that boy's a mummy. Bitch, I'm six game, catch a five, and put him six feet under. If I catch a five, I kill a five. Man, the wrong number. Walk that nigga down with four nickel and hit him in his liver. It was one of those optic ready. I think his shit optic ready right here. I like, bro. Okay, first of all, I like these visuals. These visuals is cold as fuck. Second of all, I like this nigga's flow. He got like a little popcorn reader flow, bro. And what I mean by that is like, it's like when the teacher be asking you, like, bro, read this book right here. Like, you know, the popcorn reading shit. And. You, you, you're trying to understand what the book is about, but you're a proficient reader, so you're just like, you're just reading it, but you're just trying to understand it at the same time. So it's like he's, it's like, it's like he's reading off some shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I fuck with it. I fuck with his flow. I fuck with Simba flow. Niggas talking high. We seen that boy. We turned him to a victim. Bitch, I'm Simba Love. I'm top out. You never met a killer. You were not a driller. You didn't slide about your little nigga. Walk that nigga down with four nickel. I'm finna bruise nigga. Niggas talking high. Up on the day. You want a hoop nigga? Pass my brother. Fill four nickel. It's our you up nigga. Ooh wee. Bitch, you a hug. Go put you on the blade. So I think the only thing this song is missing is some ad libs. Like some two solid dirtball ad libs. Niggas talking high. I just realized these niggas came in with no ad libs at all. Fuck AJ, his ass up in that box. Hey, I got them gunners with me if you ask me. Caught him trying to run. Damn, another athlete. Run, run, run. Beat him on the back streets. Simba hop out binary. Was a close thing. Hey, RG Dre. Do niggas often tell you that you look like James Harden? No, fuck that. Bro kind of look like Sada Baby. He kind of look like Sada Baby James Harden mix. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna call you RG Dre Sada Baby Harden. I ain't gonna lie. He hard though. I think I think I think RG Dre probably came with the hardest flow on this song. I think um Hold on. I think I think this nigga should collab with with these these. If he collab with these these, I think that would be a hard ass like uh Washington to to California link up type shit. I think that would actually low key be pretty cold. Bitch, I'm in too deep. I feel like on my ass. These little niggas beginners, they don't know how to step. I keep this baby A on me. I'm trying to make a mess. And if I catch a five nigga, put some holes in his chest. Hey, bro. I hate when fat niggas actually are low key pretty cool, bro. Cause. Like, I'm not fat phobic, and I hate when people try to spread that narrative, but this is a pretty cool fat nigga that we just seen, bro. Shout out to RG Dre, man. And happy birthday to you, my nigga. Listen, but it's time for me to come in with my honest, truthful opinion, man. I fuck with the video. I fuck with the vibe of the video, man. I like the way that all the homies was really, like, putting into that shit, because sometimes during video shoots, a lot of the homies, they don't really be locking in. They don't really be, like, focusing the video. You can sometimes see that in the vid. But listen, I like the way that everybody was low-key, like, choreographing shit i'm not sure if uh manzano bros was directing or how they were telling them to do it but if it was just like the homies going off instinct bro they were definitely cooking and they were definitely adding a lot of like flair to the video for sure uh rg sleeves k man like i said i, I definitely fuck with the lyrics that you was spitting man but the flow psh, trash that shit please psh, trash that shit it is 2024 we gotta come with a new vibe you feel me simba 5k I like your flow. You was definitely spitting some real shit, and I definitely do like the part where uh, the the whole you you are not a killer verse and everything uh, beyond that, bro. I don't know what the five did to you guys to make you guys uh, come into the stew and just get to shit talking like this and just drag these niggas through the mud, but y'all really did y'all thing. I hope that the five can retaliate in a 
good way on on the bars bro on the bars i hope that this is just straight strictly music i hope that the five isn't even a real place at this point because the way that everybody hates them bro i don't even know man the only five that i feel like it's acceptable is like the john cena waving a hand and i feel like even then you might get blitzed doing that so it's a very you know scary game right now for the uh for the five fans for the five guys um like like do you guys even eat five guys you know what i'm saying like like let me know if it's like you know 5k to the point that much you got you guys ain't even eating five guys but listen man i'm gonna have to give this song a seven and a half for sure man this song is definitely there in terms of the vibe the energy just that aura just that shit that just will make me listen again you know what i'm saying it definitely got that shit uh definitely a good song but i just hope that going into 2024 Washington as a whole, we start to expand our sounds and broaden our sound horizons and stuff like that and just get different identities in different places. You know, I feel like a lot of the music that pops in our city is a lot of the same music, a lot of the same EBK flow, a lot of the same, you know, killer anthem, a lot of the same, you know, type shit. But we really need to expand that and just come with different sounds for show. So that's what I'm hoping that we're going to hear a lot in 2024. But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you did. Listen, we're going to be dropping a lot of videos this year, so stay tuned. You do not want to miss anything. Follow my Instagram to make sure that you stay up to date on everything. Listen, this has been your boy, Vitan on the 4. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. It's a midnight, I'm drinking juice in Seattle I-5 mile, we got hoes in Seattle Diamonds breakdancing, who trying to have a battle? Pull up, leave the speakers, you can hear them when they...